Hello and welcome to jasonnewland.com My name is Jason This is your weekly sleep hypnosis Thursday or sleep hypnosis session every Thursday I hope you're well I'm recording this early hours of the morning actually it's about half past 12 on Thursday morning so I'm actually fairly tired myself so I might drift off <laughs> hopefully not but if I do you'll just uh, please forgive my snoring and I was thinking about um, what kind of session should I do today and because at the moment or recently I've been doing the daily relaxation hypnosis sessions I've had to or needed to put a bit more effort into what I'm doing and do a little bit more planning you know uh, instead of just turning on the camera and just talking although I still do quite a lot of that I'm trying to be a bit more focused so what I thought I would do with this sleep session is do a kind of body scan and scan your body and kind of similar to the chronic pain relief session that I've done in the past but instead of focusing or looking for a part of the body which is um, you know discomfort or anything and then focusing on that and changing how you feel this is a body scan where we're going to focus on the part of you that feels the most tired right now the part of you that really just could just drift off into a deep sleep and that might be how you feel anyway whenever you hear my voice especially on a Thursday these specific sessions seeing me sitting in this black chair with these microphones facing towards me and you can get a sense that it's time to let go so there isn't really that much to do it really is a case of just allowing your body and mind to do what is natural allowing yourself to do what you want to do which is just drift off into a deep healing natural sleep and by doing this body scan now it allows you to just get in touch with how you feel both physically and emotionally in this moment and at the same time you can find the part of your body which feels the most relaxed or maybe it's your mind that feels the most relaxed now so we're going to start at the top of your head 
moving down, all the way down to the tips of your toes. I'm just going to focus on it. And you're not trying to cause yourself to fall into a deep, healing, natural sleep, but that's kind of what will naturally happen. Because for every part of your body that you focus on, you just naturally feel more relaxed. It's just a natural response to this feeling feeling of focusing, focusing on letting go and acceptance, not just acceptance of how you physically feel right now as each body part relaxes deeply and enters into a healing natural sleep. but also acceptance towards yourself and your life. Self-acceptance in such a deep way. Self-love. Kindness directed within. And you can just imagine a big word, the big word kindness with an arrow pointing towards you. And you can just absorb all that kindness from that word. Feeling that healing energy of love spreading through your body. So now as we start at the top of your head, just noticing how your top of your head, your scalp feels. The sides of your head, the backs of your head. Just being aware of how you feel now. And now moving down to your forehead. Being aware of how your forehead feels now. your eyelids and your eyes, being aware of how your eyelids and your eyes feel now. The skin on your face, across your nose and your cheeks, just being aware of the sensation of the air it's as if there's some kind of a breeze just blowing against your face that you weren't aware of before and moving your focus of attention down to your mouth your tongue your teeth, your jaw, your gums, that whole area, just being aware of it. Moving down to your throat, the sides of your neck, and the back of your neck. Just noticing Is this the part of you that's the sleepiest? Does the back of your neck feel tired? And now your shoulders. Do your shoulders feel tired? Do your upper arms feel tired? Do your elbows feel tired? Do 
Do your forearms feel tired? Do your wrists feel tired? Do your hands feel tired? Do your fingers feel tired? Does your chest feel tired? Does your stomach feel tired? Does your upper back feel tired? Does the middle of your back feel tired? Does your lower back feel tired? Do your hips feel tired? Do your buttocks feel tired? Does your groin feel tired? Do your thighs feel tired? Do your knees feel tired? Do your shins feel tired? Do your calf muscles feel tired? Do your ankles feel tired? To the tops of your feet feel tired? Do your heels feel tired? To the bottoms of your feet feel tired. Do your toes feel tired? And as you've been through your body, maybe now we can focus on your mind. Does your mind feel tired? Do 
your ears feel tired do your bones feel tired do the hairs on your body feel tired does the skin that covers your entire body feel Which part of you feels the most tired? Which part of you is ready to sleep? Which part of your body wants to sleep? Does the top of your head wants to sleep? How about your forehead wants to sleep? Do your eyes wants to sleep? Does your jaw wants to sleep? Does your throat want to sleep? Does the back of your neck want to sleep? Do your shoulders want to sleep? Does your chest want to sleep? Does your stomach wants to sleep do your upper arms wants to sleep do your elbows wants to sleep to your forearms wants to sleep to your wrists wants to sleep to the backs of your hands 
wants to sleep. Do your palms of your hands want to sleep? Do your fingers want to sleep? Does your back want to sleep? Your upper back wants to sleep. The middle of your back wants to sleep, your lower back wants to sleep, your spine wants to sleep, your hips want to sleep, your buttocks want to sleep, your groin wants to sleep. Your thighs want to sleep, your knees want to sleep, your shins want to sleep, your calf muscles want to sleep, the tops of your feet want to sleep. Your ankles want to sleep, bottoms of your feet want to sleep, and your toes want to sleep. And your mind wants to sleep. And notice how easy your mind and body just drift into a sense of comfort, a sense of safety, it's as if you're being cuddled and hugged by a loved one, someone that you trust and care about, and you feel so safe and warm and loved, and you know in that moment that you can just let go and it's safe for you to drift 
into a deep, healing, natural sleep. Knowing that whilst you sleep, your body will be healing. And all those parts of your body that need attention will be healed throughout the night, throughout your sleep. Your body will be rejuvenated, healed. And when you do wake up, you'll feel full of energy, full of positivity, full of gratitude. Because when you wake up, it's another opportunity for you to enjoy being you. Every time you wake up, it's another opportunity for you to learn to love yourself even more. Every day is another opportunity to grow and to feel safe and to enjoy that safety, the kind of safety that you can experience right now whilst you drift into a deep safe, healing sleep. Your mind is always there to protect you and your body can just let go and you can just drift off safe in knowing that sleeping is the most natural thing in the world. And every time you drift off into a deep, healing, safe, natural sleep, is another opportunity for you to be reminded of just how easily you can sleep naturally and deeply. constant reminder of your ability to do what is natural and sleeping is the most natural thing in the world and from now on falling into a deep healing natural sleep just feels so easy. In fact, when you lay down and it's time to go to sleep, you may struggle to keep your eyes open. You may in fact fall into a deep sleep much quicker than you ever imagined possible. because you're just getting straight to it because that trigger has been set so when your head touches the pillow it's a trigger for you and your body to completely relax every muscle every thought just switched off. Drifting away instantly and naturally. In such a way that you can really, really love 
sleep in and really look forward to going to bed knowing that things have now changed you have now changed which means you can have more appreciation for yourself and your ability to make these decisions to transform your life in a way which allows you to have more self-love and allows you to be so much kinder to yourself moving forward into the future brightening up that future changing and stretching your mind to open up to possibilities that maybe you never even thought possible. Wonderful, beautiful ideas of an amazing future that you can have for yourself just by sprinkling that love onto the path of your future brightening up that future in ways that may amaze you and delight your heart it's as if you're planting the seeds for future happiness that future involves you being able to drift off into a healing natural sleep easily and naturally whenever you choose just by placing your head onto your pillow you can naturally drift off because that's the trigger for you to know that it's time for every muscle in your body to relax naturally and for your mind just to switch off and drift into a healing natural sleep allowing you to recuperate and your body to rejuvenate giving your body and your mind a rest so that when you do awaken you'll be full of energy fully alert ready for the day ahead feeling positive full of love and kindness just enjoy that feeling of serenity and calmness enjoy knowing that you really can just let go it's so easy to just let go it's the simplest thing in the world it's as easy as saying the word sleep so when your head touches that pillow you just fall into a deep healing natural sleep
a feeling of safety, full of love. And you can dream of a beautiful future, full of happiness. This brings us to the end of this session. Thank you for watching. Enjoy your sleep.